President Buhari invites Tinubu and others to iftar dinner. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. President Muhammad Buhari of Nigeria has invited Bola Ahmed Tinubu, the national head of the old Progressive Congress APC, and a potential presidential candidate in 2023, as well as 17 other dignitaries to an iftar dinner on Tuesday evening. Others invited to the meeting include former APC chairman John Oyebu, former Edo governor Asham Adam Sushimole, BC Akande, former Ogo state governor Olushego Osoba, and former Bruno state governor Almodou Sharif, according to an invitation letter seen by Politics Nigeria. Among those invited are a former Zamfara State Governor, Osemihi Osumbo, former Secretary State Governor, Ahmed Yarima, former Yoruba State Governor, Ali Womako, Boka Ibrahim, General Mohamed Baguru, and Senators Lawal Shaibu, Aba Alji, Tijani Tumsa, Fatih Bala, Abubaka Guru, and Nasiru Dam. I write to inform you that President Major General Muhammad Buhari retired has directed that an invitation be extended to the attached list of the All Progressive Congress leadership to join the President in breaking the Ramadan fast on Tuesday, April 26, 2022 at 6.30pm at in the Presidential Banquet Hall, State House, Abuja. In this regard, you are cordially invited to invite them. The leaders are required to report to the pilot gate at 4.30 p.m. for rapid COVID-19 testing at the State House Conference Center and to be seated by 6 p.m. <laughs> this one, there is an invitation of IFTA to everyone. First of all, the wife of the president. The wife of the president, First Lady Aisha Buhari, who came back from Dubai not long ago, invited all presidential candidates and people who are almost doing gymnasium. People said everything they said. People did all the whole gymnasium and stomped, you know. People like, oh, that's so, so, so and so, Tembo will not attend. Who is she? What powers does she have? And I was like, do you even know why this woman called for this meeting? Has she ever called for a meeting like this before? Something must be up. And she even included, please, I mean, do not call me to phone. It means the matter must be very serious. I was thinking, okay, it was our African mentality here and how we continue to see the woman. Oh, but unfortunately, people attend. To the people surprised, Tinubu attended. I think a, a whole lot of people attended. People who were not even expected to attend did attend. Now, the president is calling on people. Oh, let's, let's hope that they're going to discuss or let's hope, uh, you know, maybe they'll fill us in with detail because the meeting that the first day they had with um, those presidential candidates, we did not hear anything, and I think uh, um, it was because due to the fact that um, they agreed not to, you know, spill because she, she she instructed them not to come with her phones. Well, let's hope and hope this meeting is going to bring out good things. Right now, we need solutions to our security challenges of the country. We need solutions to the banditry, the terrorism that is spreading almost in to every geopolitical zone in the country. So let's hope that at the end of the day, maybe they are going to discuss solutions. Just maybe. Okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of the day.